Hadir packs a punch. It saves her from unwanted male attention. Here on the streets of Cairo, sexual harassment can be a common experience. Her training partner, Wala, is just as fierce. She's Egypt's heavyweight boxing champion. Strong women in a macho world. And out on the streets, they say they're never afraid. I don't want to boast, but I am, in fact, a heavyweight boxing champion. So I'm the man of the house and out on the streets. Women's boxing in Egypt is only a fringe sport. But according to the coach, there's no shortage of talented women. The challenge is finding them and supporting them. It's not as though this is only a sport for men. There are many women who become world champions. And in Egypt, this is especially possible. We have many strong and very talented women. But they don't have it easy in Egypt. There is a deep-seated prejudice and many stereotypes that still endure. Boxing is a brutal sport. I think it's better for women to avoid it. After all, women are not good at enduring violence. When I see too many muscles on a woman, I think it looks disgusting. To see muscles everywhere, ew, no, I detest it. But those views aren't shared by everyone. Wala's nephews are fascinated by their aunt's gold medals. They are her biggest fans. They want to box too one day, but it's a long road to get there. Wala has been in the ring for seven years now. Her mother is proud of her youngest child and even of her powerful punch. Boxing is actually self-defense, and she's had to defend herself many times. I remember how she beat up three boys at school who harassed her severely. One of the boys had attacked her with a pencil and almost killed her. Wala and Hadir also enjoy cooking at home. But when the two girls talk about the future, marriage is something Wala doesn't want to rush into. She intends to take her time to find just the right partner, and she knows that might take a while. Usually, the boys complain when a girl is stronger than they are. That's why I want to find someone who really understands me, preferably someone who also participates in this sport, who gets it and who loves it. By doing what they love, these female boxers are also fighting for women's rights in the Arab world and for the right of everyone to follow his or her own path towards fulfillment with no holds barred.